Despite having cloud technology and being able to access files in the cloud from any device, anywhere where you have an internet connection, sometimes you do need to transfer files from one medium to another. And the best way of doing this is to select the files that you want and to compress them into what is known as a zip file. To do this, you select the files that you want to compress, right click on them, go to send to and put them in a compressed zipped folder. I can rename this devman, which is the same as the parent folder, and now I've got a zip file. You'll see that the size of this zip file is substantially reduced from the sum of these. In this case, this would be well over 630k and it's been compressed to 626. Sometimes when you do this, the compression is even greater than that. It does make life a lot easier in transferring files. To open the files, you can view inside the zip file here. But I'm looking at the files, but they're still within the zip file. If you want to extract them, you right click and then do extract all. And then you get options as to where to put the files. So that's how you achieve compression of files so that they can be transferred.